hello aquarius how the freak are my aquas doing hope you guys are doing well welcome to your may 2022 prediction um we are going to be looking at overall love for the month of may new love your work your career i will also be pulling a guidance card towards the end for you know anything that you need to know for the month of may guys okay all right so let's get a crack of lacking i literally started talking and it wasn't even recording but i got this card out <laughs> Um, open heart, be receptive to partners who don't immediately match your usual type. Um, please remember that this is a general reading. Take what makes sense for you. Leave the rest. Please like this video. Support your fellow aqua guys. All right. May 2022 for Aquarius in love. May 2022 for Aquarius in love. May 2022 for Aquarius in love, please. May 2022 for Aquarius in love. What do we got? What do we got? They don't gave up on us, Aquarius. <laughs> they gave up on us. Right. So you have reunion. You will get back together after time apart or after a breakup. Okay. That's interesting. So this may not be someone that obviously you were in a relationship with Aquarius. This could just be somebody that you've been separated from. But then you have true love at the bottom of the deck. The love of your life is entering the picture soon. You will be happy. Okay, don't aggravate me. Don't aggravate me. Okay. <laughs> May 2022 for Aquarius in love. What do we need to see, spirits? All right, so Aquarius, you have the Knight of Cups, the Five of Swords reverse, the world. May 2022 for Aquarius in love. May 2022 for Aquarius and love. What do we got, Spirit? May 2022 for Aquarius and love. So you have judgment. You have the emperor, temperance. You may be connected to an Aries. You may be connected to a Sagittarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius like yourself. May 2022 for Aquarius in love, please. Ace of Wands. Seven of Cups. Six of Coins. So I feel like Aquarius, um, you may find that you have a lot of options in the month of May. Okay, I do feel that. You got options. Some of you may be online dating. Maybe you meet this person online, okay? But because reunion came out, I kind of feel like this may be somebody that you already know. Um, and you guys f fell out for X, Y, Z reason. I don't know if, the, I mean, maybe you were feeling defeated here. <laughs> this freak defeated you or you defeated them. Maybe you guys just got into some kind of, you know, argument, whatever. But I feel like this freak wants to redeem themselves. The world... I feel like, um, damn, you have a lot of Major Arcana. The world judgment. And you have tempers. There will definitely need to be some forgiveness here in the situation. And they want you to forgive them. Um, you may be dealing with your divine masculine if you believe in twin flames. Because the emperor can definitely be the divine masculine, right? So, this is what they want, Aquarius. They're going to come in as the Knight of Cups. They're coming in very romantic. They're coming in with their heart on their sleeve. Uh, they're opening their heart to you. It may be them that needed to open their heart too, okay? Maybe they were just a, a hard ass with the emperor. <laughs> whatever the hell this freak was doing, breadcrumbing you or whatever it was. I know this person may ask you on a date, Aquarius, or something like that with the six of coins. What is the knight of cups for Aquarius in love? Tell us about the knight of cups. Knight of cups, please. <laughs> I like when that happens. Knight of Cups with the Knight of Cups. That's funny. Then you have the Emperor. And then you have the Three of Wands. Okay. So this person could be at a distance from you. But the Emperor is here again. Uh, they, this Emperor may be difficult to deal with. They may have a lot of pride, ego. They're a little bit stubborn. But uh, I feel like they want to compromise with you. The Temperance card. They, they just want to basically... <laughs> They want to re reach some kind of uh, middle ground with the Aquarius here. They don't want to lose you. Who child? Tell me about the Five of Swords reverse for Aquarius in love. What is the Five of Swords reverse here? 
So, you know, they, they, they feel regret for how they treated you, what they said to you, whatever. Okay. And I feel like it may have been because this freak was just very guarded, closed off. For some of them, they were very focused on their work. What is the world for Aquarius in love? What is the world? Four of Swords. Oh, so this person, some of you, this person was very inconsistent. Okay? They didn't know what they wanted in the past. They were back and forth. But now, apparently, they, they know what they want. <laughs> All right. What is judgment? They made their final decision with judgment. What is judgment, please, for Aquarius in love? Yeah, for some of y'all, I feel like this person wasn't ready, okay? They weren't prepared. They weren't ready to settle down or something like that, guys. Tell me about the emperor. Tell me about this emperor. Maybe they thought the grass is greener. Whatever the hell this freak thought. Six of cups, ace of coins, and the three of cups. So this emperor is going to come in and reconcile with you. If there was a third party, there is no longer a third party, Okay. They made their mind up, <laughs> apparently. I feel like this, this emperor is not going to come empty-handed. It's like they want to take you on a date. They want to do something sweet or something like that. What is temperance? Higher fence. Yeah. So this person wants to do the right thing. Six of coins. Wow, you're going to be happy. Six of coins clarified by the nine of cups, the sun and death. You're going to be happy. The world. You're going to be happy about this, Aquarius. I wouldn't even be surprised if some of you get an engagement, okay? But the world usually shows up when you're starting a new chapter in your life or you're ending one. So I do think this person wants to start completely over with you. You guys could probably get the passion back or something like that. It's going to be a passionate, brand new, uh, you know, situation here, Aquarius. I mean, look at that. Emperor, Empress, Divine Counterparts. Wow. So that's nice. That's nice, Aquarius. Yeah, I think this person right here that I'm seeing is someone that you have a history with. This could be your child's father. Um, it's kind of what I feel for some of you, okay? Maybe this person has a child. This could be a businessman, businesswoman, somebody who is a little bit older than you, okay? Or they could just be a freaking... Uh, <laughs> or they could just be a damn stubborn egomaniac jerk sometimes, okay? <laughs> but yeah, they've made up their mind. They want to start over with you. They want to have this new. They want the new cup with the Aquarius. What else for Aquarius in love? May 2022, what else? Three of coins. They want to rebuild. That's what they want. They want to rebuild their relationship with you. Yep, you have death here. Transition, transformation. That's what it's about. Wow. Knight of Swords. So apparently this person knows what they want. And what they want is to rebuild what they had with you through a Swords Reverse. They may even hurt you with a third party. They may have hurt you with a third party, guys. Okay? But either way, they want you. Point blank, period. Um, but like I said, a lot of forgiveness. A lot of forgiveness, Aquarius, is going to have to be had here. If you guys are to start completely over. Okay? You got to let the past be the past with this freak. Point blank, period. Temperance is forgiveness, okay? All right. <laughs> so let's see. New love. New love for Aquarius, May 2022. New love for Aquarius, May 2022. You're juggling, Aquarius. You're juggling. You're juggling. New love for Aquarius, May 2022. You're juggling. Wow. <laughs> okay. This new love, Aquarius, I hate to say it. This new love could be involved. This new person. If you meet a brand new person, guys, um, this person could be involved. Let's get two cards for new love in the month of May. Let's get two cards. May 2022, new love for Aquarius. May 2022, new love for Aquarius. This relationship shows a lot of potential if you are willing to put in the work. Expectations, unrealistic expectations are keeping you from meeting your life partner. Yeah. For some of you, this person could be in a relationship, okay? Um, and they're 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 not sure if they want to leave yet, okay? If this is a brand new person. 
or it, i mean this could just be someone that you met and whatever but i kind of get that vibe that someone could even be married here and they're juggling so as much as you might want to be with this person you're gonna have to i mean i don't know it's almost like there's no guarantee that this will actually happen okay now if it's not a third party guys i feel like yes this person sees your value they see your worth um they do like what they see but i feel like i don't know if the two of coins is your energy you might be uh you might find yourself having a decision to make because you have someone else and then you have this other person so you gotta pick what you want i think they both see value in you aquarius that's what i feel they both see it um, I think this person is being pretty consistent with you, okay? They are serious about building something long-lasting with you, but the two of coins, like I said, is the problem here. Yeah. Um, what is the hangman? Yeah, some of you may have something to do with uh, this person being very focused on work, finances, okay? Others of you may have something to do with this person um, being involved, okay? And they can't make their mind up as to whether or not they're going to leave, okay? But I just feel like, um, like I said, this person does see your value. They see it. They do see it. Tell me about the three of coins. Tell me about the three of coins. Three of coins, please. The world, the sun of coins, the first ten of cups, and the fool. Yeah, I feel like Aquarius, I mean, divine timing is at play if you're dealing with someone who may be involved. But there's no telling if they're really going to be, I don't see this person. It's going to be quite a wait, okay? Um, I feel like you may have this other situation like we just seen that may be better for you, okay, than this person or whoever the hell this person is. Some of you, it, I mean, the choice could be about you basically um, wanting to be with somebody else, okay? Wanting to work on things with somebody else, okay? If that's the case, you know, just need to be honest. New love for Aquarius, May 2022. New love for Aquarius, May 2022. New love for Aquarius, May 2022. Seven of coins. There's a whole lot of coins here. And when I see the king of coins, sometimes it can definitely talk about someone who's involved. But either way, Aquarius, um, it's either that this person's work could be coming in between. There's some kind of third factor here, okay, for this new love. Um, it could also be conflicting schedules or something like that. But both of these people, I strongly feel like they both see your word. They see it. Um, and they want a piece of it. Um, but at the end of the day, I believe it's up to you what you want to do here, guys. Okay. Working career for Aquarius, May 2022. Working career for Aquarius in May of 2022, please. Working career for Aquarius, May 2022. Working career for Aquarius, May 2022. What is coming? Hmm. This is interesting. I wonder what this is about, Aquarius, because it's almost like... Hmm. For some of you, I'm kind of getting that you could be... There's something that's worrying you in the month of May, guys. Um, some kind of injustice could be worrying you, possibly in your job or what it, with whatever you're doing. But I feel like it's saying that you're kind of making it more than what it has to be in your mind, Aquarius, with the Nine of Swords. Um, if you're at a job or something that you're not fulfilled in, you keep alternating between, you know, just doing it, not wanting to do it, wanting to leave, not wanting to leave. So you got to kind of make your mind up here. What is the Four of Cups reverse? may be some kind of like you may have to work something out with this i mean with where with wherever you are there may be some kind of negotiation or you may need to negotiate okay what is justice reverse but i feel like the main thing for you is that you're feeling like you're not getting what you deserve okay some of you could be comparing yourself to um that's more specifically for business owners out there you could be comparing yourself quite a bit um you're kind of making yourself unhappy but you're going to have a choice to make two of wands knight of wands four of coins 
What is the Knight of Swords? What is the Nine of Swords? Oh my goodness. Come on, come on, come on. All right. I feel like if you feel like you could be making more uh, more money somewhere else, you should you should just go for it. Okay, don't be afraid to go for it, um, because I feel like there will be some kind of opportunity. Okay, you don't have to put up with something you feel like you don't deserve. Okay, if you feel like something's not fair or they didn't do you right or whatever it is, you have the um, the opportunity to either a negotiate it. This could have something to do with some type of claim, something having to do with the law within your job. So this could be, for example, like a workers' comp or situation or some crap like that, okay? Um, <laughs> but yeah, like I said, but then you also don't need to stay in something or somewhere that you feel is not, you know, treating you right or giving you what you deserve, okay? So it may be time for you to move along if that's the case, because I do see opportunity coming towards you in May. 2022, three of cups, three of coins, you could be going on a... Um, on an interview, okay? For those of you in business, I feel like you just need to basically, um, I think it's more of a mind thing for you, to be quite honest. All right? All right, so let's see. Any advice for Aquarius in May 2022? Any advice? All right, so you have Adriana. I'm leading you towards the answer to your to your prayer. Okay, good talk. Please listen to and follow the steps I am communicating through your intuition, thoughts, and your dreams. So there's a need for you to definitely pay attention to your intuition, Aquarius, and your uh, thoughts and your dreams, guys, okay? Important messages are being relayed um, to you. So then you have Archangel Uriel. Your emotions are healing, which enables you to open to greater love. I will help you release anger and unforgiveness from your heart and your mind, okay? All right, cool. So I hope you guys enjoyed this prediction. Thank you guys for tuning in. Love you all. Talk to you soon.